Hi guys, it's Monday again, a new week, and I'm kind of late on today's challenge, um, but we are on day 12 of the 31 day live on purpose challenge, and I've really been challenging you all to kind of look deep into yourselves and figure out what it is, um, or rather how you can live a more purposeful and empowered life um, focused on intentional living. And so with that being said, today I want to challenge you all to do something that makes you uncomfortable, right? Because it's in that discomfort and it's in that so-called pain that change happens, that growth happens. And so for me, I've actually, I'm participating in today's challenge because as you can see, I'm outside, right? And I'm broadcasting live. So one of the things that makes me really, really uncomfortable is to do um, these kind of videos out in public because it just seems weird to me, right? And part of the mental... Uh, feedback that goes on in my head is that if people look at me, they're going to think I'm crazy because I'm talking to myself, but I'm not because they don't know I'm talking to you all. But in any case, it really freaks me out and it just makes me feel really, really uncomfortable. Um, so I decided to do that to push myself. And now that I've done it, it's not as bad um, as I've led myself to believe. So today, I want you to dig into yourself and think about something that makes you uncomfortable, something that you normally would not do um, either because of fear of doing it or just because maybe you're afraid of what others may think about you, all right? So I see Marilyn. Hi, Marilyn. Thank you for joining me. Stacy. hey girl. Thanks for tuning in. I'm talking about doing something that makes you feel uncomfortable and how when we challenge ourselves to do that thing that makes us uneasy um, one we conquer a fear and two we realize that um, just pushing through the discomfort actually allows us uh, to deal with it and then the next time we go through that thing it's not as uncomfortable so I'm actually getting home um, but I want you to just sit with that for a second. Think about it. Think about that thing um, that you normally wouldn't do and focus on doing that today. Um, I would love to hear what that is for you. So please post it in the comments or private message me if you don't want it to be in a public forum. Um, and please make sure you continue to follow my daily challenges. Um, please let me know. Is this working for you? What insights have you realized about yourselves um, within the last... Uh, 11, 12 days since we've been doing this. And um, also, if you are on Twitter and Instagram, please connect with me at I am Nancy Ruffin. I look forward to engaging with you. Um, and so have a wonderful, blessed day. And until tomorrow, my friends.